Okay, folks, so here's my model, Miss Yanasia. And so here is her before. She is a natural hair client, and we are going to add in some chestnut brown, um, chocolate brown highlights. So I parted off my sections, and I'm going to start in the back. Um, Yanasia is new to color, and we want to give her some baby steps. So we're just going to do some chocolate um, and maybe some chestnut brown highlights. And I'm gonna do the weaving technique, but I'm gonna take some chunkier sections to really give some nice chunky highlights. So here I have a second formulation. I went in with two formulas. Um, the first formula is a darker color. This was a 7NA, and that is the lighter color that I used, the 7NA, which is what I'm using here. And then the first color that I went in with was a 6N. So I'm alternating between the 7 and the 6. I did use an ash tone for my undertone because um, Yanasia's skin, she looks like she has red undertones. So I wanted to go ahead and put a little bit of ash in the formula just to counteract some of those red undertones. And um, yeah, that's what I'm doing. So I'm just basically alternating the folds between the red, I mean between the 7N, A, and the 6N. Okay, so here's a sneak peek, and as you can see, it's already changing into a nice chestnut brown. I got out of focus there, but here's a better shot. Yep, so we can see that that color is starting to lift just a little bit. Okay, so of course we're ready to get her to the shampoo bowl once it's already processed. And we're just gonna go in and we're gonna neutralize and shampoo and condition and all that good stuff and she is just having a good time just swinging her little feet and everything so we're just gonna give her hair a really good shampoo going to go in with my Fusion 365 and this is by Naked. Um, this acts as a heat protector, a leave-in conditioner, and a detangler. Um, and then you'll also see me go in with a protein shake, which is just, it's just a spray protein. And this is by Elabor. So now I'm just going to go in and start blowing her hair out. And I'm going in with my Epic Blow Dryer and a paddle brush. And I seem to get the best results when I use the paddle brush and this Epic Blow Dryer. It really silks the hair out and gives it a very sleek appearance. Um, this is an ion blow dryer, so the technology helps to keep the moisture in the hair without over drying the hair, but it still gives a very sleek and silk look. Um, you can also start to see those chocolate brown highlights that we placed in there. It looks really, really good. Um, these are definitely the, the shades that we were going for. We didn't want something too, too bright. So I was very, very happy with the results. Okay, so she's blown out. And now you'll see me grab a little bit of my Satin Silken and Glaze. This is also by Naked. And I'm just going to emulsify that and put it all throughout her hair. And you can see I only used a dime size amount, and this is for her whole head. So you don't need very much, but this set... Satin Silken and Glaze is a heat protectant, but it'll also provide a very nice shine when we go in with our irons. Okay, so now I'm just gonna put some really loose curls in her hair. Um, she just wants like really flowy and bouncy hair, so I'm not gonna do too much when it comes to styling because typically she just kind of wraps it and lets the curls fall anyway. So I'm just gonna go in with my Epic Iron um, Flat Iron. I think this is a one inch, and I'm just gonna put some loose curls in. All right, so after curling, I just kind of wrapped around in a little beehive. And
and we're gonna comb it down just to really loosen up those curls and give some volume to the hair. And we decided to go outside so we can really capture this color because sometimes the lighting on the inside really was kind of messing with the color. Um, and again, we were able to accomplish these nice chocolate highlights with no bleach. We didn't use any bleach whatsoever on her hair. And look at the contrast of the color. Just a reminder, this is what she looked like before and this is the after. I mean, that contrast of color is just absolutely amazing. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see y'all soon. Bye-bye.